Hello everybody and welcome to Corey Turner Talks Cars and we've got some new episodes of Name That Car and Picture That Car coming up this week as well as a which car is worth more. But right now I'm going to show you my top three picks from my searches of Craigslist today and I went to Baltimore, Maryland. So let me show you which cars I picked out as my top three. First of all, okay look I know it's not necessarily cool to drive a Hummer. It had a a pretty bad wrap there for a while, a lot of excess, a big car, uses a lot of fuel. All of that is totally true, I totally get it. But they are really cool cars, are really cool trucks, especially in this age of SUV now, right? So here's one, this is a 2006 Hummer H3, so if you were gonna get one, this was probably the uh, less impact on the environment, right? This is a four by four, uh, it's a 2006, has 135,000 500 and uh, 135,278 miles on it. They've got some extra touches uh, that they've done to it there. You can kind of see um, all the way around. Uh, to call this the small one, it is the small one, but it still is a really big truck. There's the interior. It's got the tan leather. Um, let's see. This gets 16 city, 20 highway. So for a Hummer, that's really good gas mileage, right? Uh, this one looks like it's loaded out, heated seats. Um, what else does it have? Of course, AC and heat, all that's good. Middle of the windshield has a crack in it, it says. So, all right, so there's pick number one. It's the 2006 Hummer H3. Uh, the next one, okay, the Bentley Brooklyn's. The, this is a 1996 Bentley, has 95,000 miles on it. It is in that British racing green. And trust me, they carry that all the way through. Look, the seats are in great shape. Look at that. Look at the dash. It is green, just like the outside of the car, right? They're wanting $17,999 for this one. You can see that wood dash, real wood dash, right? It's got the veneer there. Um, very cool car. Uh, you're getting the Bentley badge. That's pretty awesome. There's the information on it right there. Uh, man, of course, manufactured in England. Um, so you get to say you're driving around in a Bentley. What it costs to do that and the maintenance involved. Um, but anyway, you're driving an awesome car with an awesome name, right? And then the last pick of the day, look at this. A 1991 Camaro RS convertible. It's in that teal green color. Um, Boy, that is just a really good looking car. It's got the, oh, hello. Yeah, I'm over here heading to the car. Um, hey, they got a barbecue grill right there. Be good on barbecue cookout days, right? Uh, it's got the cloth interior. It is the automatic. Um, is that a CD player? It's got the CD player in there. Um, that is a very, looks like a really dirty steering wheel, right? Maybe the top, I wonder if the top goes up. Oh, let's see here. Only issue needs a new top. So, okay, that that might be it. That may be why we're having the situation that we're having there. Uh, 110 uh, miles per hour on the dash. This one has, what did they say? Is that like 112,584 miles, at least that we can see. The old top is still there. It's torn in, around the back window. So the top is still there, but it needs a new top. Power everything. But that is a good looking car. It looks like the body's in really good shape, too. So that was my pick of the day, the 1991 Camaro RS convertible, the Bentley Brooklyn's, and the Hummer um, H3 4x4. So of those three cars, which car would be your top pick of the day out of those three? So be sure and leave that information in the comments. Uh, and like I say this week, we've got a name that car, a picture that car, and which car is worth more, worth more is on its way. So be sure to keep checking back. Remember to like, comment, and share, please. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let's go car shopping tomorrow.